You have 48 hours to create a fashion film. You want to get a trampoline on a rooftop tomorrow. That sounds incredibly dangerous. Uno, dos, tres. I could easily flip over the edge and like, I won't be doing Nave anymore. Welcome back to Neva. I'm Angel. I'm Esme. I'm Jasmine. I'm Faith. And we're, we're in a car. Oh. We're no, we're Neva. We're Neva and we're in a car. We're Neva. We are a new show here on YouTube about beauty and fashion and loving yourself. And cue the trailer. Cue that. We're a little group called Neva. This is fashion. We are going to smash this channel. Oh! <laughs> This is gonna be freaking awesome. We are trying a new format today. We're gonna be in a car, whipping around. So our director, Ioni Baloney, is whipping. Say hi, Iona. Hi. She's beautiful, isn't she? So if you guys like this format, make sure you give us a thumbs up and we can do more cool stuff like this. If you haven't subscribed yet, make sure you subscribe and hit the notification bell so you never miss us. It's early, we don't know what the hell is gonna go on. It's gonna probably be a really intense challenge, but I'm really excited about it. Same. So right now, we're on the way to the Levi's stores because in this episode, we're doing a challenge with Levi's. <laughs> They just came out with the highest high-waisted jeans they've ever made called the ribcage jeans. It's literally up to your ribcage. Like, the title explains it all. We just got dropped off on Regent Street in front of the Levi's store, which is right behind us. Our friend Chloe is here. We're going to meet up with her inside. She's going to explain the challenge to us. And I want to know what it is already. Hi, I'm Chloe. I'm a photographer and filmmaker. And I'm going to be setting the girls their challenge today. Oh. <laughs> Okay, so how are you feeling? Are you excited? Good. Yes. Yes. I'm so, so excited. So your challenge is going to be really fun, but it's also going to be really hard. Mood. <laughs> Mood. She said, screw a challenge. I'm going to give you a mission. <laughs> so basically, the challenge is you have 48 hours to create a fashion film. 48 hours? Two days? Girl, what? Oh. Uh, how are we going to do that? So there's two rules. Basically, the first rule is that you have to work as a team on this. Okay, you can do that. Dream team. And the second is that the film needs to celebrate the theme of height to do with the ribcage jeans. Okay, cool. That sounds really, really good. I think we could do it. So in two days, you're going to see me and two other judges who are going to be looking at your short film. And your time starts right now. Oh, what? <laughs> wait! Okay, okay, okay wait, wait. Step one, we need to go, we need to get our jeans before we can do anything else. We have 48 hours to do our short film. We have to scope out the scene and find the ribcage jeans. Oh, ribcage, ribcage. So I want some black jeans because black just goes good with everything. Where did Ez go? Oh, <laughs> you know what you need with Esme? A little leash, like those little kids. Hey, these aren't them. Where are they? Oh, here. Oh, ribcage. Yaga. Oh, wait, they were all right here hiding. <laughs> these are the ribcage straight ankle. Yeah, these are kind of like the 90s mom jeans. I think they're going to be really cute because they're high rise. High rise is always cute. Oh, damn. They really are. Oh. Holy camoly. Holy camoly. And they button up all the way up so that'll be cute too. It'll be nice and snug and tight. You're such an er earl. I love it. Ooh. All right, so we all have our jeans ready. We need to make sure that they're kind of like different. We're not all wearing the same ones. Mm -hmm. And just try them on. Er, eh, I'm bleeping it out. Er, right. er. So you guys, we got a brainstorm. Let's think of some ideas. What's the first thing that comes to mind when you think of height? Ready? Go. Ooh. Ooh. Mountains. I really like these. I feel like they're so flattering. It's Still flat. And they like make your legs look really long. Yeah. Basketball players. Basketball players. They like elongate your silhouette too because yeah. they're so high that they just automatically make you look so tall. I think of skyscrapers, sky, space, uh -huh. flying. I recently saw this fashion film and it's like these kids, they all like meet each other, they start running, they run up to this rooftop in New York and it's just like really beautiful. I feel like we could really recreate something like that here in London. From just doing some moving and some acrobatics in these jeans, I know that you can fully move in these and we can do stuff like jumping, long jump, oh, high jump, oh, bungee jumping, oh, ooh, ooh. oh my yes. god. Yes. Ah! Ice Ice waist. Waist. Come back, 
everybody say something about a rooftop? We should do rooftop and we should like get a crane to like find a way to make us suspended in I air. I don't like that idea. Why? It sounds like the most ultimate wedgie. <laughs> How about we jump on a roof? Okay, what if we just do a trampoline on the roof? But we won't get the trampoline in and then it'll just oh, oh. be us in the air. Okay, so you guys want a skyline with a trampoline on a rooftop. Like, that sounds realistic. Yeah. How are we gonna do that? I really think we need to talk to Paz, our producer. So, Jazz is gonna call Paz, and she helps coordinate all the shoots for Neva. Hi, Paz. Hi, Paz. Hi. And so, we are just sat in the car right now, brainstorming. She's she gonna say no. no. And before you say no, hear us out. No. Yes. <laughs> Wait, you didn't even hear. Okay. You didn't hear the rest of it. So we were thinking of getting a trampoline on the rooftop so it looks like we're flying in the air. That sounds incredibly dangerous. And we need to do it tomorrow. You want to get a trampoline on a rooftop tomorrow. I told y'all she was going to say no. Okay. So you're going to have to get a location. You're going to have to get a stunt coordinator. Guys, realistically, okay, we could meet up with a stunt double today. Jackass, where you at? Get some lessons. Be prepped for tomorrow. And then and then we can be safe and we'll know what we're doing. Insurance check. Me. I've been to a trampoline park in South called Flip Out. We could do that. We can do that. We're going to try, but it sounds very unrealistic. Okay, okay. thank you. Bye, Bye. Bye. Thanks. Bye. Bye. Okay, so when I went on my date with Zach in South, I went to Peckham Levels. Oh yeah, Peckham Levels, of there's course. There's like a whole rooftop area. Does it have an elevator? Yep. Okay, where do we get trampolines from? Paz has connections for everything, and I feel like she can do it. Maybe we should go to PAX and get some like beauty stuff. I just want to try this out really quick. So we basically jumped in the car. We know what we want to do. It's just now about making it happen. So we're at PAX picking up beauty supplies that we need, and the girls are messing around. Shuffle battle. <laughs> Crumb battle. Let's go. Let's go. <laughs> what is that? The only rules were height and teamwork. Let's go. But OK. Great. Come okay, on. OK, let's Come go. On. I have a friend named Christian I met at gymnastics here in London, and I think that he'd be perfect. Really? He is a stuntman, he is a gymnast, and he also does parkour. Parkour! Yeah, but would he be free and everything? I don't know, but he's really cute. <laughs> if he's cute, he's hired! Hey, hey Christian! Hey. hey! Are you free today to go to Flip Out? Yes, yeah, absolutely. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Christian, thank you for coming wow. today. So basically, we need you to help us learn some flips and some tricks. Great. Have any of you bounced on a trampoline before? Yes. Can you guys do any front somersaults or back somersaults? I can do I front, can. front one, but I land on my butt. Front flip. It's probably better to start with your hands up. You want to throw all your weight forward. Like Whoa, that. there goes that. We want to look cool, you know? We want to look like we know what we're doing. And we need to be safe. One, two. two. We need to be fashionably safe. Three. Three. There you go. Oh. Whoa! The goal for today is to manage our movements and just make it look effortless and graceful in the air. One, okay. two, three. You. three, go. Ow! Oh! oh. You all right? oh my <laughs> god. Is that meant up? <laughs> Tomorrow, we are not gonna jump with our weaves because they will get snatched. So, Christian, I have an idea for it to be a shot of the camera going up into the sky and then me like going across and I can do like a pose or maybe even a flip. So today's been fairly successful. The girls have given it all their effort. I think tomorrow they'll do really well. Um, I think it'll be safe and they'll have a lot of fun doing it. <laughs> we have come to the end of a long day and we've had so much fun bouncing on trampoline and it has been so fun. I think Christian thought that we were absolutely insane. <laughs> yeah, we tried to take him as serious as we could today. We were all on trampolines. It was kind of hard. I came here to teach a lesson. 
What is this commotion? He was just like, is that supposed to happen? That's what he said. Feeling super excited for tomorrow. I feel like we got a couple tricks down and perfected our poses. We got yeah. a lot on our plate and we're about to finish that plate like it's Thanksgiving Day. Ooh, that metaphor. Don't go anywhere. This Thanksgiving face is gonna be immaculate. <laughs> <laughs> We just got here, it's early, it's cold, but the sun is coming out, which is exactly what we need for all the shots. So today's gonna be a really, really exciting day. I'm so excited to see how our flips and tricks are gonna turn out on camera. We're gonna be like, we all did our hair natural today as well. Yep. Are you guys proud of us? So Mark and Christian are on their way with three trampolines and crash mats. Complete. Oh, wait, watch out. Whoa! So today I'm going to do a backflip, front flip. Christian, the stuntman, is here, so he's gonna be helping us out. I'm Faith. Nice Thank to meet you. you. Hi, I'm Jasmine. No weave today, so she can boing all she wants. Where's the lift? This is gonna take forever. There's so much stuff in here. We need to get it all the way upstairs. Uno, dos, tres, cuatro, tres, tres. Twist okay. it again. Twist a little bit. Yeah. <laughs> Wait. Just move! All right, so right now, Dom is doing my makeup. I feel really good. I feel like the video is gonna turn out really good. The weather is really good. We got cameras everywhere. It's really good. It's feeling very good right now, right? Right. So I'm just chilling here by the clothing rails. We have so much cute stuff. We have tons of accessories, socks. Look at this. We have the rib cage jeans and this color, the blue, is my favorite. Esme and I are repping the Levi's rib cage high waisted, the highest of them all. They're so cute. Above the belly button, up to the rib cage. Just how I like them. Waist trainer who? They fit good, they make your butt look Behind us is a bit of commotion. We got the boys working, hustling, grinding. They setting up the boxes. Do you know what they're for? They're for if we like fall off the trampoline, then we fall on the boxes. <sighs> right, so the boxes are here to protect you if you fall. Boxes have been used in the stunt industry for years and years. They first used them in places like Hong Kong because they didn't have airbags. Now in the stunt business, time is very precious. So we have to fill the box really, really quick. quickly. I'm really good at this right now. <laughs> I'm really proud of like the team and everyone working with us because everyone's working so hard to pull this all together. I just can't wait to get dressed and get the show on the road, get jumping. All right, so first shot of the day, I'm skating in the parking structure. We got Rip over here filming me with this big old camera. It's ginormous. A lot of big camera stuff going on here, so it's pretty serious. It's a real deal. One, two, three. I'm gonna skate up to like the stairway scene. And then me, Angel, Esme, and Jasmine are gonna meet up. I'm gonna hop off my skateboard and then we're all gonna run to the trampoline. It's a great shot and I cannot wait to see how it all comes out. I think it's gonna look Phenomenal. Ew. Right now we're watching the footage that we just recorded. Ooh. See how it looks like. Oh, oh it's yes. cute. <laughs> <laughs> this morning we came here bright and early and we basically got all the shots in of us running up to this moment where we are about to finally jump on the trampolines on the roof. Just look at this view behind me, like this is amazing. We have our trampoline here, we have crash mats, we have boxes, but I'm highly terrified because there's a trampoline and then there's a ledge. So the reason why this trampoline is super close to the edge of the building is because we're trying to get the effect that we're flying like in the air. So like I could easily do a flip and like flip over the edge and like I won't be doing Nave anymore. But right now, it's my turn to do a flippity dip, so. So, 
We are in the middle of filming our trampoline scene. Jazz is going up, and she's pretty nervous. She's kind of scared because Jazz is just always scared of stuff. There's no crash mat that could save me. I'll probably still injure myself. And yeah, I think we're killing it. I've been looking at the monitor, and it looks so good. Angel and I are watching Esme through this monitor right now. And, oh! <laughs> and she's down. Our whole project is coming together and it feels so good. I'm so happy. It's like, as soon as we lifted into the air, all the stress and worries from today was left in the air. <laughs> Two days ago, I would have never imagined me being on a rooftop with my best friends filming a sick, sick short film in the sunshine, let alone. Yes, it looks really, really so good. So good. It actually looks like we're flying. And yeah. Levi, just thank you so much for even giving us to have this idea in our brains. Like, thank you. So we were standing there looking at that monitor, watching all the girls jump around with the fabrics, and it was just beautiful. Like, everyone was safe. We got the shots. Hair and makeup was great. The jeans fit perfectly. The and fact then, we did this in two days, like, I was looking at everyone, all the crew, the trampolines, everyone jumping about, and I was yeah. like, this happened in two days. Like, it wasn't just us, it was everyone as True. a collective. It was amazing. Now all we need to do is just take all that footage, edit it, and like give it that vibe that we want, that like aesthetic, editorial, fashion film vibe. So we are here with Shani, our editor for Neva. She is an icon. She's the She's best. She's the best. Ooh, Ooh that was that better. Good. That's perfect. <laughs> I run stupid. I hate me running. Ooh, okay, Jasmine, fire. All right, it's literally 10 p.m. right now, and we have like an hour or so before we need to like submit this stuff. <laughs> I just want to go nap, nap now. So we're running out of time. We're all so tired. I'm gonna sign off so I can get to it. So we're back and it's Judgment Day. We have an amazing panel of judges here today. We have PC. Hi, I'm PC Williams. I'm a stylist and lecturer at St. Martin's. Sophie. My name's Sophie Jones and I'm a photographer and film director. And we got Chloe. I'm really excited to see the film and see what they've actually managed to do in 48 hours. We actually did it in 48 hours. <laughs> have you guys seen them, the ribcage jeans? They're really cute. I think they make everyone's bum look amazing. Right. Yeah. <laughs> that is facts. That's what we've been saying. If you want your waist popping, snatched. Popping, snatched. Popping, everything popping. You comment on this video because you might be able to win a pair of Levi's jeans. We have five pairs to give away. So we really wanted to work as a team and celebrate height since the ribcage jeans are the highest high-waisted jeans Levi's has ever made. We had to make an actual short film for a huge company that I've known about since yeah. I was like a little girl. So before the short film starts, I think we'd all like to know what you guys are looking for. I'm just interested to see how you guys brought it together visually, hair, makeup, styling, how does that all link up together? I've struggled before with like having an idea in my head and then actually having to shoot that and trying to get it to look exactly how you see it. So I'm kind of excited to see how you've managed to do that. I was really interested to see how they were going to tackle height. I want to know how you are able to tell a story in that minute and how the edit and everything else is going to help aid your storytelling. Damn, okay, they're cool. so like legit. Yeah, Those sorry. are like some serious <laughs> points. <I'm> like... <laughs> We just made a movie! I was already nervous when I saw the judges and then they started speaking and like telling us about like their requirements, what they were mm -hmm. looking for. I'd be interested to know before we play the film if there was anything that you could have done slightly differently. Mm -hmm. That was a very short amount of time to do what we did. Yeah. So yeah, if anything I would say, I just wish we had more time. It's not only 48 hours to make a fashion film, we also are doing the episode, you know? So it's actually, we're doing two things in one. We're filming an yeah. episode as well as making the campaign. Mm -hmm. So like, it was just a, a lot, lot that had to go into it. I really liked this challenge. Yeah, it was, it was really, good. really cool. It was fun. It was stressful, but at the same time it was fun. It kind of gave us the little like anxiety the whole time, kind of like knowing like, is it going to turn out good? What we did was actually so dangerous. <laughs> and like, I feel like that's something that if we had more time, we could have like improved that and like made it more safe. Yeah. I want to see the film now. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> yeah I want to see it too. I want to see you see it. <laughs> <laughs> okay, can we dim the lights, please? 
foolish to abide this Your eyes are hypnotized No one knows you make me shiver You're my ghost, I feel you creeping A phantom by design Just a lover opening shot is it's brilliant really cool. yeah because i think that you don't really you're setting like a tone it feels intense but it also feels sort of like you want to know more do you know what mm -hmm. i mean i just love that shot where faith was spinning on the trampoline considering the brief and the 48 hours and it's your first fashion film i think it was an amazing video and i think the tonality of it was amazing generally i think you guys smashed it thank you thank, thank you. you our judges were absolutely amazing they were yeah. just like amazing boss women thank you so much to levi's this was actually surreal. We have five pairs of Levi's to give away to you guys, so make sure that you guys like, we're gonna check, and comment down below. Tell us how you would style the jean. Hit that notification bell so you never miss us. And we'll see you next week. More Neighbor Madness. <laughs>